KIDK Eyewitness News 3 continues. A new memorial is being built in Bannock County. I wanted to find out more about it and what makes this one so unique and to pay it forward. What makes this memorial different is it remembers the fallen, but it also recognizes and remembers the families. Rebecca Webb met Herschel Woody Williams at a convention in the summer of 2018. Rebecca says Williams is the last surviving Marine to wear a Medal of Honor from World War II. He created the Herschel Woody Williams Medal of Honor Foundation to bring a memorial to every state. Rebecca wants to see one in Idaho. And I was inspired to bring this monument back to the state. It was after the loss of my son. I lost my son, Master Sergeant Christopher Webb, in June of 2017. Master Sergeant Webb was a veteran of Operation Iraqi Freedom. Here is what the Idaho Gold Star Families Memorial Monument will look like. It will be built in the new Northgate development just north of Pocatello and east of I-15. The land is donated by Portneuf Development. The plaza will sit on half an acre with parking and a path with informational markers leading to the monument itself. The monument will be made of black granite, the same as the wall in Washington, D.C. In the center, a soldier saluting facing west. When the sun sets in the evening, um, it'll create a silhouette. Forty-four stars encircle the monument, one for each Idaho county. There will also be five feathers representing each Native American tribe in the state. Ten flags will surround the monument. The U.S. flag, saluted by the soldier, the POW MIA flag, the Gold Star Mother's flag, honor and remembrance, and one flag from each military branch, plus the state of Idaho flag. We want it to be a place where families and, and all of the citizens can just reflect on what's happened to and remember our fallen. The monument will cost approximately $250,000 to complete. The amount is being raised entirely through countless donations and some grants. I've never wavered that for some reason I am supposed to do this. It might be to help other Gold Star families around the state. Time to pay it forward. The monument means a lot of things to me, Todd. You know, a lot of emotions in this. I think it's been healing for me, good for me, but I I am excited moving forward. Rebecca, Farrier and Jen, I'm Corey with Mountain America Credit Union. We've heard about what you're doing and all the time, effort, sacrifice that you're putting into bringing forth the Gold Star Family Memorial Monument to our community. And because of that, I'm here today to pay it forward. So I brought with me today $500 <laughs> in cash that I know you're going to be able to put forth. Good effort, good use of it in bringing this monument. Um, to our community. So we have Mountain America Credit Union. I pay it forward. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So You're welcome. So much. You're welcome. Very appreciative. You betcha. Thank you. The groundbreaking will be held two weeks from today, April 24th. Construction will take place over the summer with completion anticipated for this fall. Our Pay It Forward stories air the second Wednesday of every month. So if you know of a nonprofit organization or someone who deserves to be recognized for their contributions to the area, let me know. Just log on to KIDK.com and click on Pay It Forward off to the right side or under the Lifestyle tab at the top. Fill out the form on the submission page and click Submit. It comes right to me. Or you can send me an email to tkunz, that's K-U-N-Z, at KIDK.com.